And I was talking with my sister. It was one of the first conversations I really had with her ever. It was after I had left for, um, for Montana. She's being 18, and we never really had that close relationship till I left. And we were talking about you know, her and Gran and her future. And there was something uneasy, and I, I kept trying to push and figure out what exactly it was that was going on. But the thing that stuck out to me about you guys is she said that whatever issues are coming with, whether it's between each other and each other's lives, they don't want to project that on the world, that, that the only way they're going to survive as a couple is to talk amongst each other and handle things. And I think that's something that stuck out so much to me, and I knew right then and there that you were going to be the rock that she never really had. So I appreciate that. Dear Mrs. Heaster, almost. Well, the day is finally here, and I couldn't be any more excited than I am today. I bet you look so beautiful right now. To finally be able to tell people, yes, that's my wife, is something I've always been waiting to say forever. We've grown so much together, but nothing has made me happier and proud to see just how many obstacles you have not only overcome, but conquered. Wow. Into, into the holy state of matrimony, Grant and Alyssa. Are you excited? Yes, I'm ready. Relax, relax. The, the fun is just beginning. We're happy that you found each other, and that you find such joy in each other, and we can see that in the smiles on your faces. <laughs> Go ahead, you can try to, you know, that's the smile, that's the one. But we are also here to help you add the and. Alyssa. After 14 days of meeting you, I told you I was going to make you my wife. And here I am before you today. Grant, today I have loved you for 2,271 days. I once desperately prayed for something to save me. And without knowing that, it was you. With God by our side, I promise to be the man that you deserve to honor you to love you, and to always be a faithful husband to you. I promise to never take a second of our life together for granted. I promise to listen to you and to be a safe space for you. I promise to be your safe space and to support you in times of pain and in times of joy. I promise to love you, although it may not be perfect, it will be all of me and true. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness.
I vow to love you how I want our children to love their spouse. I love you. I vow to be your faithful wife. I vow to see you as a gift. I vow to help you love life. I love you. Until you meet your chariot. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Started with a good night kiss, my lips, your lips, baby, let's just keep getting there. Started with a long goodbye, get wrapped up tight, let's spend all night right here. It started with a good night kiss. I wish that we ran swim. I don't know who could not be here this evening. Recorded a message. You and I have been friends for a long time now. From kindergarten days, it's now on your wedding day. The reason I call you my best friend is because you helped me through the toughest times of my life. Because you were never anything but what I needed. Someone to lean on who truly cared and a friend when I needed it most. And I know you'll be the exact same way with Alyssa because that's how amazing you are. I wish you guys the best of luck with your new life and your new marriage. I love you both. Kelsey and I were actually the ones who got these two together. Yeah. Alyssa posted a picture on Instagram of her Nutella hot chocolate, which Andrea commented and simply said, Can I get that recipe? Liz, I'm so thankful for somebody like you in my life. Basically, he's always been my role model, and you guys have been like the relationship I look forward to. And I hope all your dreams here have come true today. To you both, I can't believe it's finally here. The newly married couple, I wish you a lifetime of love. excited for you. We are proud of you. May God be with you, Grant and Alyssa.